Hello and welcome back to my tutorials. In this tutorial I will speak about Virtual Machine Manager so you can create your own virtual DSM. That's meaning you basically can create a second uh, Synology NAS interface. On this way you can test uh, new features, new uh, stuff and even install betas from Synology before you put it on, on your live system. If you don't have a virtual machine manager, you should install it. I can help you if you look one of my other um, tutorials, but else you can uh, make a comment and I will help you. Let's start in virtual machine manager. You need to have the image, uh, virtual DSM. If you don't have a new image, you can see my version here. You can click create and download the lastest one. You can upload it from your PC, or you can select the, the file from your uh, Rackspace. Rack uh, station, sorry. Rackspace is the server provider. Mm -hmm. uh, going for the virtual machine uh, overview and click uh, Create. You should click on the Synology Virtual DSM. And here we want Virtual DSM test. I only want one CPU and one gigabyte of memory only for testing and then we have the list of DSM if you need some features from the old OS you could basically install it if you need to test the, the beta versions of Synology's DSM you can download them yeah test it so let's say we want to be able to use uh, to see a bit of data. I want to use my default network. If you have more, you can yeah, create more networks. I don't want to uh, auto start it, so I just leave it on no. And I don't want any of my user to to be there. So. In this case, I will just uh, want to power on my virtual machine and apply my settings. I will uh, use my exist license. This is the free one. So I mean, it's because the free one could only have one virtual machine at the same time. What you see is the Ubuntu test I'm making. It's uh, in the previous uh, uh, tutorial. And now it's uh, basically powered on, having no IP addresses yet. I will wait for, for the network. So that's it. Thank you for watching my tutorial. Um, if you have any question, you can make a comment below. And I hope you will like this tutorial. If you will watch more, then subscribe my channel, and you will uh, get more. Thank you, and see you next time.